Hey guys, in today's video, I will teach you how to fix your COD mobile controls in your Bluestack application. So first, let's go to our Bluestack app here. So it's now open. Let's go to the right icon here. Go to the settings. Let's go to the basic. Let's go to the bottom. Let's go here at the custom layout. So here's the sample layout that we can reference to in our control. And now we need to go to the game controls here at the right side. Click here. So you can see battle royale and multiplayer. This rent is what I created earlier, just a customized control. So to fix your control, there are options like smart control here but right now it's unavailable so to fix that we need to create our own control so just click here control editor and create our own customized control okay let's name this new control enter okay and now we have this empty uh, space here so what will we do is to add controls so first we need to add the d-pad uh, drag it here so okay it's all set up WASD I will just uh, look for my reference here go to the settings okay shift so let's go back to our new control again go to the settings add shift here sorry shift shift all right this is for the sprint then let's see the other settings of this pad let's copy the x and y properties 1903 let's copy all of it sorry okay 1971 okay I'll just copy the controls okay 7 20 what else Guys, I'm just referring to my uh, wrench controls earlier. I just copy it. Speed. Okay. Go to our new control. Speed 100 and make it zero. So when you close this, it automatically updates the control. Okay. So I think it's fine. Yep. Let's go to the rest. Okay. So next, um, okay. Next, we need to add uh, settings here. So for me, it's uh, the primary gun is it's one. Secondary two. Just click and just type whatever numbers you want to input. And this four, five. Sorry five six and okay what's next this knife letter V this E and uh, let's see um, okay bomb three R uh, three here reload R Crouch C and what's this? Space jump. Alright. And here we got um, the firing control. Wait, let me get this. Okay. Alright. So, in order to add a firing control here we need to drag aim pan and shoot drag it whatever you want 
then go to the settings here settings of it Je then click fire with left click after you click that click this drag this here oh wait here you need to drag it here for it to have an uh, firing input when you click uh, your left mouse then next scope think this right click am I correct all right okay I think we're all set up tab Q okay Q here all right and what we got here so it's F and F just, just copy the controls guys FF I think we're almost done and yep and also remember you can change this to tab because I want to use this it's more comfortable to me so th this tab is what uh, you can do to remove your mouse cursor to unhide or hide it so let's save it okay I think we're all set up now new control okay and now let's try it in our training mode start let's add some sounds okay let's try it if this thing works all right so this is the okay let's pick sniper as you can see this cursor here you need to click tab and now we can see that it's working let's see the right click all right all right it's working let's try the sprint yep shift it's working the sprint crouch yep jump yep up secondary I think it's working let's try it up up reload yep it's working so that's how you create your controls in the COD mobile blue stack in any application so it's very basic this will work if you don't have smart control in your blue stack application so I hope these things works I hope this helps stay active and God bless Grand Zero One Game